Hello, now if you're somebody who wants to play an instrument but finds the piano a little bit too Elton John and isn't really challenging enough to play covers of Oasis on the guitar and strum yourself for hours in your room, then by golly gosh do I have a new instrument for you. The Cat Accordion, one of England's traditional instruments dating back to 1982. Now cat accordions aren't easy to play and they take a lot of practice to become as good as I am. Um, so I'm going to take you through a few basic steps that you'll need um, to learn how to play one of these marvellous instruments. One of the first things you're going to have to do is find the right instrument for you. This one for me is the right size, um, it's brown, I like the colour brown, um, and basically fits into my arms really, really nicely. Now before we start playing the cat accordion, there are a few safety checks that we need to do to make sure that it's going to play really well. The first one you're going to do is basically you need to get into the right stance. So this is how you hold the cat accordion, just like this, okay? And the first thing you have to do is give a little blow into one end, okay? And that clears the pipes and makes the sound come out a lot better um, than if you didn't blow it. If you didn't blow it, then it kind of gets a bit clogged up and um, makes it, you know, not as nice to do it. So I'm going to play a very short song on the cat accordion. So make sure you grab your cat accordion just like this. Hold it up and play. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. And that's basically how you start off playing the cat accordion. Uh, make sure your grip's right, one hand here, one hand here. Make sure you do the safety checks, a little blow, um, to clear the pipes out. Um, and just make sure that you just practice every single day and then one day you'll be good at a cat accordion, uh, just like me. Isn't that right? So thank you for watching, thank you for listening. I hope to see more videos of you people playing cat accordions in the future. I've been Ash, have a good day.